Hey everyone, I completely forgot to start filming this when I started the dish, but that's okay. I'm going to just start from where I left off. My friend Christine gave me this recipe. It is for a chicken stroganoff, um, and I'm excited to try it, so I will let you know how it turns out. I am starting with six chicken breasts in the crock pot. I put in a 16 ounce um, container of sour cream, mixed it with um, a can of cream of mushroom soup, and a bag of, what is this? Lipton's onion dip. So just mix that together and pour it on top of the chicken breast. I'm going to cook it on low for six hours and then I will shred it and put it over um, egg noodles. I might even put in some frozen vegetables in there just to get something in there with it. So I will show you what it looks like when it's done cooking in the crock pot and finish the next few steps with you. I'm going to go ahead and add in two cups of mixed vegetables. Um, I've already put one cup in, so I'm going to go ahead and just add the second cup, and we'll see how that goes. I just thought it needed a little something else. Okay, here is the finished product. Um, I sh shredded the chicken already. Now, when I first opened the lid, it looked really soupy, like I thought something wasn't right with it, but... After I shredded the chicken, it's already starting to thicken up. Um, I turned it off so that it would start to cool down and thicken up. And then I'm also going to add an entire bag of egg noodles to this. And I wanted to let you know, we're a family of eight. And this recipe will give us at least two dinners. So there will be plenty here for us to eat for two nights. So I'm just whipping together the noodles. I'm going to throw some biscuits in the oven. And we will let you know what we think of it. All right, everybody, this is the final product, and I've already tried it, and I think it's pretty good. I can keep close up there. So chicken stroganoff, we're serving it with a salad, oranges, and a biscuit. I've got the kids ready to go. The babies are over there. They're double fisting it already, so I think I would call this a win. They seem to really like it. I am enjoying it, so. I think it's a success. So I am going to put a link to the recipe in the description box. And if you have any questions, leave a comment below and I would be glad to help.